okay students now i will give you this worksheet open page number 24 in your book exercise a b and d you have to do in your copy in and in your book also so uh, start with exercise a fill in the blanks when we switch on a pc the opening screen of windows is called desktop answer is desktop uh, number two dash means we can perform more than one task at a time it is called multitask Number three, we can pin our favorite programs on the dash test taskbar. The dash features allow us to turn the open windows transparent and make the desktop visible. It is called arrow key features. Now, number five, the dash icon provides an easy and quick way to open any application or software. It is shortcut. Number six, the shortcut icon has a small dash on its lower left corner. It is called jump arrow. Okay, now 1 to 6 is from your book. Now I will give you some extra fill-ups. Number 7, Dash is the latest version of Windows. It is Windows 10. Dash is the founder of Microsoft. Who is the founder of Microsoft? Bill Gates. Now press Dash key to delete files and folder permanently. It is Shift plus delete. Number 10, the shortcut to create a new file is Control plus N. Now move on to next exercise, V, true or false. In Windows, we can run only one program at a time. It is false. We can run multi, many programs at a time. Number 2, 7 is the latest version of Windows. No, it is 10. Windows 10 is the latest version, so it is false. An operating system controls all the activities of a computer. It is true. Right clicking on any icon will display personalized option at the bottom of the displayed list. It is also false. The shortcut menu is also called the context menu. Yes, it is true. So now, C exercise I will give you later. Now we have to do first exercise D, multiple choice questions. Which button opens the start menu? It is start button. You have to take right here. And dash is a collection of relevant files stored together on some storage devices. It is folder. Windows is a dash user interface. It is graphical user interface. You have to take here. So, all three exercises you have to do in your copy and your book also. So, that's all for today's class. Next topic we will do in our next class. Till then, goodbye and take care of yourself.